The West Mifflin School District now says accusations that a school board member shared the football team's game plan with an opposing team are credible. Yeah, but Mark Uhas tells KDK's Mamie Ba it's not what the district thinks. I didn't give no inside information on. Mark Uhas defending himself against accusations that he gave out the game plan of the Titans, the district he represents, to an opposing team. In a one-on-one -on -one interview, he tells me that is not what happened. So I would never do anything to hurt these kids. And basically, you know, I, I love a lot of them like they're my own kids. Last week, Wednesday, Mark says he was in the area when the Elizabeth Forward Warriors were practicing. He tells me while watching, he and Warriors coach Jacob DeMarco got into a heated exchange. Oh, I just says, well, I wish I was going to be here Friday night to watch him one wild, wild kid up here. On Monday, the district sent this letter to parents. Superintendent Jeffrey Souls writes in part, the facts the district has gathered correlate with the accusations made. Yuhas's son, Shane, was the assistant coach of the Titans. He tells me he was terminated Friday, just a few hours before the game. They say that they did a thorough investigation, but um, I was never questioned, never asked anything. I think that I was used as a pawn in, in, in a political game here. Mark tells me resigning is out of the question. Looking into our cameras, he said this to anyone coming to the upcoming school board meeting. Speaking out to all of the West Middle community, come. Come to the meeting Thursday. Come hear what I have to say. And then at the, at the end, then you can make an honest judgment. I reached out to Elizabeth Forward. The superintendent tells me he is happy with how his staff handled this. I also reached out to Superintendent Souls, asking him to respond to claims that this whole thing is politically driven. But I did not hear back. Reporting in West Mifflin, Mamie Ba, KDKA TV News.